Uh, so far, I think preseason has been a lot of fun. I think that the NCA making the new rule with the 114 days and allowing us to have eight days uh, prior to the start of October 15th has been exciting, new, and challenging. Um, but it's been, uh, everybody's been working really hard. Uh, we've been able to see some things early and really work on our conditioning and, and then still really get ready for the October 15th start date. Our goals this year are really just to um, reunite this team, uh, work on our culture, getting us back into uh, the culture that uh, breeds the good family atmosphere and then that will take care of the wins and losses. We're not really gonna talk about that a whole lot this year. We just wanna really wanna talk about working together, getting to know each other on and off the court and um, I think with half of our people being new, um, either from freshman or transfer, uh, it just gives us an exciting time. It's a great time to restart. Uh, we're looking forward to seeing what our returners can do for us this year. We obviously graduated a very large class, um, so the expectation on some of our young returners is going to be exciting and fun. Um, they're working really hard. They care about uh, the program. They care about each other. And so it, it's just going to be a fun uh, season to see all of that play out with them. We do. We are returning some players that have some pretty decent minutes under their belt for such young players. Um, you know, excited to get some of our injury players back and um, just want to see what they can do. Yeah. So our new freshman, our incoming transfer, uh, it's actually a very talented group of eight. And so we're just really uh, anxious to see how they can adjust to the college level and make the adjustment to Stevenson and and really in just what we're trying to do here. Um, but very excited about their talent level. Yeah, so uh, we talked about a young lineup. So we definitely have a young lineup, but the uh, scheduling hasn't changed a whole lot. It's still a really, really tough schedule. Um, as you mentioned, back-to-back -back weekends on the road. Um, fortunately, one's fairly local at McDaniel. Looking forward to just being able to play some different competition in both of those tournaments that we wouldn't normally play. Um, of course, you know, keeping our uh, friendly rivalry with Salisbury and um, adding uh, Christopher Newport back to the schedule who was in the national championship last year. Um, so we're definitely going to challenge this young team early and often. Yeah, conference play is definitely the goal uh, this year we are the way the scheduling is going to end up we don't start conference play till january so all of the tests and challenges that we're going to face in november and december the goal of that is to get us ready for conference play because ultimately that's what's going to lead us to the next step in where we want to get to as far as you know being able to get to the mac championship being able to get back to the nca tournament we've got to take care of conference play and, and the conference is always tough uh, these coaches are great they bring in really good players they develop their players so we're going to be challenged at every turn in the conference